sweet Polly purebred, famous TV reporter was returning from covering a big story when the small plane she was flying ran into a big thunderstorm. The little plane was buffeted about and finally went out of control and started spinning toward Earth. Sweet Polly, terrified, called for underdog. Far away in the great city, humble, lovable Shoeshine heard the faint cries for help. Excuse me, sir. If you don't mind, I'll shine your shoes another time. Hey! And quickly darting around the corner, Shoeshine stepped into a telephone booth and became Underdog. When Polly's in trouble, I am not slow. It's hip, 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 and away I go. <laughs> And soon, Underdog's ultrasonic hearing led him to the spot where Polly's plane had gone down. I see that I have come too late. Polly has crashed in that old crate. Oh. Hark, a voice I hear. Polly's alive and very near. Underdog, my hero. <laughs> what strange land is this? Where are we? They were in the strange land of the Picayunes, pitiful, poor people who had been enslaved by a wicked witch. Until today, it was you, O oh wicked witch. But just a short time ago, there came to this land one who is more powerful than you. No, no, who can it be? Show me, I command you. That, that silly looking thing? That is one called Underdog. His strength and powers are unlimited. Nothing can harm him. Only one, sweet Polly. Ah, oh, e. I shall capture her, and then Underdog shall be in my power. <laughs> if you're ready, sweet Polly, I think we should go. I don't like this place, I want you to know. Yes, of course. But before we go, I'd like to get some of those strange flowers in that field over there. Will you go and pick some for me? I'll be quite safe here under this friendly tree. But as soon as Underdog left, the tree turned out to be not quite so friendly. I've got the flowers. Now we'd better... Polly? Polly? Where are you? What had the witch done with sweet Polly? There's more trouble ahead in our next exciting episode. In our last episode, the witch had stolen sweet Polly, and now Underdog was looking for her. Sweet Polly is in trouble, that I know. So it's hip, 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 and away I go. Meanwhile, the wicked witch had taken Sweet Polly to her castle high on a mountain. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm making you a little drink, my pretty. <laughs> it will help you sleep. But I don't want to sleep. But I want you to. Drink this and you will sleep for a thousand years unless some hero comes along. 
somebody gives you a kiss or something like that. Speak! <laughs> I won't. You will. Won't. Will. Won't. Will, will, will. Ah, uh ah. -huh. Oh, oh. He, he. Oh. 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 I feel so sleepy. At that very moment, Underdog was questioning the poor enslaved people of Picayune. But he always got the same answer. We cannot say. We do not know. You'll have to ask the witch. Ask the witch. Ask the witch. Ask the witch. The witch. Ask the witch. Where is this witch of whom you speak? If she's got sweet Polly, she's the one I must seek. She lives in a castle. Up there. But beware. She'll cast a spell on you. A spell? Beware. She's wicked. 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 She's wicked. wicked. I am a hero, tried and true, so it's perfectly clear what I must do. <laughs> There's no need to fear. Underdog is here. Dog. Where is Polly? Tell me quick, or I'll send you flying on your own broomstick. Nothing simpler. There she is. <laughs> asleep. I've put her to sleep for a thousand years. Only I know how to wake her up. Wake her this instant. Not so fast. Not so fast. You must do what I say. I give the orders here. Nay, nay, nay. Never what you say. This Very well, for Polly's sake, I'll do what you ask to get her awake. That's better. First, I want to see if you really are powerful. I want you to go into the arena and fight my little pet. <laughs> and so, a short time later, Underdog found himself in the arena, alone. as you can see. Now wake sweet Polly and set her free. Aha! Whoa, whoa! Eee! Not so fast! I have three tasks for you to perform. If you do them, then I will awake sweet Polly. <laughs> what are these three tasks? Will Underdog be able to do them? There's plenty of excitement ahead in our next episode. In our last episode, the Wicked Witch had cast a spell on Sweet Polly and was now forcing Underdog to do three tasks. as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. This stealing water I cannot do, for then I'd be as wicked as you. Then Polly will sleep for a thousand years. What was Underdog to do? Putting his great calculating brain to work, he came up with a brilliant idea. Shooting straight up. Up, up, until he was almost out of sight then straight down at tremendous speed. There's no need to fear. Underdog is here. And pouring through thousands of feet of solid rock, 
he struck water. Here's plenty of water, it would seem, to make this dry land fresh and green. But now for the second task. I want to make this land the richest in the world. Go steal all the diamonds from every country. If he steals diamonds, he'll be wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Stealing diamonds I cannot do. Then I would be as wicked as you. Very well. Then I won't wake Sweet Pie. If you don't do what I say, she'll sleep for a thousand years. A difficult problem. But once again, Underdog put his great brain to work and soon had a plan. Leaving the castle, he hurried to a local coal company and using his amazing strength, squeezed each lump of coal until it turned into a diamond. diamonds you'll ever need. I hope they satisfy your greed. Good. Good. Aha. And now there's one more task left to do. I rule the greatest land. I rule the richest land. Now, I want to rule the most powerful land. Everyone in the whole world shall be my you, underdog, shall lead my army into battle and conquer the whole world. If he does that, he'll be wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Wicked as the witch. Conquering people I will not do, for that would make me just as wicked as you. Alas and alack, my duty is clear. I must spare the world and leave Sweet Polly here. Can it be? Is Underdog going to forsake Sweet Polly? What else can he do? The answers lie ahead in our next exciting episode. In our last episode, the Wicked Witch had told Underdog that unless he helped her conquer the world, she would not break the spell she had cast on Sweet Polly. And Underdog refused. Alas and alack, my duty is clear. I must spare the world and leave Sweet Polly here. So, you refuse, do you? Then Sweet Polly will sleep for a thousand years. Are you going to leave her? I must leave, Polly, but before I do, I intend to really take care of you. That's what you think! escape me this I vow. Come and get me! <laughs> so, you want to fight, do you? Well, fight these! Bye, man! 
With the Wicked Witch finally disposed of, Underdog went back to the castle and the poor, pitiful people of Picayune. Where is the witch? The witch? Is she gone? Is she coming back? Oh, I hope not. The witch? Where's the witch? Where is the witch? The witch? The witch? Where is she? The Wicked Witch is gone for good. You can now speak up like people should. Three cheers for Underdog! Hooray! 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 But the cheers did not make Underdog happy, for he thought that with the Wicked Witch gone, no one could awaken sweet Polly, and she would sleep for a thousand years. Don't worry, you saved us, Underdog, and we will watch over sweet Polly. We will, and our grandchildren will and on and on, until she wakes up a thousand years from now. Very well, good people, I shall entrust her to you. Farewell, sweet Polly, you're always true blue. I'll find some way to save you, my pledge is this, and I'll seal my vow with one final kiss. Just as the Wicked Witch had said, and Underdog had unknowingly vowed, his hero's kiss had broken the magic spell. And amid the cheers of the Picayunes, Underdog picked up Sweet Polly and headed for home. What new adventures await him? Don't miss our next exciting episode. <laughs>